What's up guys, Bob Oscar here at Think Computers. I'm gonna be showing you how to set up Synology's RT1900AC router. Now this setup's supposed to be extremely easy, I've never done it, um, so I'm gonna record my process to show you just how easy it really is. Um, now we're doing it via our desktop um, directly connected in. You can connect to the router via Wi-Fi, you can connect to the router with a mobile device um, or an app that they have set up so you can set this router up every, you know, pretty much every way possible. But um, for us, we're gonna do it right here on the desktop. So we're, we have our browser open here and I'm gonna go to 192.168.1.1 and that should take us to the setup here and it looks like uh, we're ready to go it says link and share all the possibilities so we hit start and we set our username here so let's set a password my password's probably weak yeah um, you can send anonymous data to Synology if you want I'll, I'll take that off we hit next Setting up your Wi-Fi network, so SSID, um, of course this is what your, your access point is going to be called. We'll do Think Computers, and we'll put in a password. Alright, so we have our password in there, we hit next. Wi-Fi is currently disabled. Before you use, please press the Wi-Fi switch on your router. So I actually have to go over and press the switch to turn Wi-Fi on. Um, but we'll go ahead and go to this. Set your operation mode, um, which we have the choice of wireless router or wireless access point. So if you want to use this as just an access point, you can, or you can set it up as a router. We're going to use it as a router. External access to SRM, so you can set up access um, to the software if you want from an external source. So we'll uh, have that enabled. Um, and it says router mode, the Synology router we import connects to the internet via DSL, which we already have set up. Hit next. Set up your internet connection, auto IP. Um, you, have the, you have the option for PPPoE, manual IP or auto IP. Uh, I'm using Comcast. So uh, auto IP here, we'll hit apply and it's setting everything up it's saving our settings i assume it's going to reboot the router uh as well that's typical here all right so it says con congratulations your synology router is set up setup is now complete and it looks like here we go so that is how easy it is to set up this router again the big thing with this router with a lot of uh for a lot of people is that it's extremely easy to set up the software is extremely easy to use so that's the whole idea behind this router now we're going to go into the software in a second video but this video is just to show you just how easy it is it probably took me what uh maybe two minutes three minutes to, to go through the setup and get it you know ready to go um, so if you have any questions about setting up this router go ahead and leave it in the comment section below so next time catch you guys later Thank you.